okay, had to pause it for a minute because I got a video phone call and had to go attend to that. So I'm back and we have our cone here. All right, so next we're gonna go ahead and draw a cone on the side. Okay, you may or may not run into this situation, but it's a really good thing to learn. So as with when we did the cylinder on the side, to do the cone on the side, we start with another ellipse. And I'm going to tell you over and over again, don't try to be perfect. Okay, let's move this down just a little bit. Don't try to be perfect with it. And just the more you practice, the better you're going to get. Okay, so there's my ellipse on its side. And I'm going to go ahead and draw the line through. You don't have to do that every time, but for teaching, it really helps. So just like on this one where the center line is at a right angle, whoops, center line is at a right angle to the bottom. Well, this time the center line is going to be on a right angle to the side. All right, let me fix this. Here we go. So here is my center line of my cone. And again, I'll decide how tall I want it. Looks a little crooked. It's really interesting because what I'm drawing on the paper is a little bit different than what I'm drawing on the screen. I don't know if the camera is distorting it a little bit. So, if my lines don't look as straight as they should, you're going to have to forgive me. I just got this camera, just learning how to use it. All right. So again, when we do the lines on the side, they're straight lines. They're just diagonal. Maybe one there and one there. Now, I will be honest, when I teach these to the high schoolers and they're working on drawing their forms, they get really tired of using the center line. As a result, I get this, where they draw the front and then they try to sketch this and it's not even, okay? That center line really helps you because I'm trying to get it as even as possible here, and it's really not, okay? This also helps it make, look, excuse me, helps make it look more three-dimensional. Now, like with any guidelines, if you want to erase them, go ahead. And there's coming. Okay, I would practice as many as you can. Don't forget that center line, and the more you do, better you're gonna get.